Alright, it is 6.52 a.m. I'm on my way to Bart's. Pick him up, head down to Austin, Texas. Picking up Roy at the airport today on Thursday. Tomorrow, Whiskey Dick. Bill gets in as well as Chad and Sarah from It's Bourbon Night. I spend some time, drink some whiskey, break in the Crowded Barrel uh, Distillery with the Whiskey Tribe on Saturday, and we'll keep you updated, updated, updated. There will be some live streams and uh, all kinds of shenanigans going on in between now and then. So later. This could work as one of those YouTube videos where you get to see the accident right before it happens. Yeah. I got 18 bottles of whiskey. Wow. Some heel sleighs? Got some heel sleighs in uh, there, including there uh, there's some George T. Stags, there's some Van Winkle. Wow. There's some E.H. Taylor four grain. There's a Tomatin 36, which isn't a heel slayer. There's still a lot of that bottle left. Stuff for Roy to be able to sample. I figured I'd take uh, more bourbons just because he doesn't have bourbons in Scotland. I mean, I've got uh, out of 18 bottles, 10 are probably bourbons, eight are scotches probably. Well, yeah. I, I wanted mean, to take some bourbons. He lives in stuff. Glasgow. Yeah, here's a scotch. It's, yeah, exactly. It's made in Glasgow. <laughs> oh, thanks. Glad I drove that. You probably have on a plane. You probably haven't had. Yeah, you haven't heard cast. of that. Yeah, this is this is kind of close to your parts, but here's a gift. Here you go. Okay, uh, we got out of Wichita oh. just after seven. It's uh, coming up on ten o'clock a.m. We right. stopped. Right, we're stalking a liquor store in Oklahoma City. What? It's the name of the liquor store. Freeman's Liquor Store. We'll show you the front here in a minute. Right. But uh, Scott met... keeps telling me it's great. It does not look great on the outside. Uh, yeah, the outside <laughs> does not. It's very deceiving. Yes. That's probably why it's um, got the stash that it has. Okay. Uh, Daniel Willis had brought us here when we came down to meet Swami a few weeks ago. Um, very good selection here. So Bart wanted to run by. I did too again. Mm -hmm. Look out. They had uh, an Oklahoma... Has some pretty good prices on their whiskeys. It's good. Uh, Elijah Craig Barrel Proof for forty-three bucks. Good. Hopefully, yeah. Hopefully, they still have some. Wow. There. And that was the new batch too. You really screwed me. You, you think? know that's showing it. You got it pointed in the general direction. Hopefully. Yeah. That's Freeman's Liquor Store. Like we're at the paint. We're at the corner of forty-third and something. Forty-third and something. <laughs> that's a. I did have a girl. We went into Seven Eleven. She goes, "I love your shirt. That's cool scotch." We are southbound in Oklahoma City. We got done at Freeman's Liquor Store. Three bottles, baby. We bought three. Three bottles. That was Brett, and we met Tony also in Freeman's. Brett and Tony. Yep. Brett and Mate. Tony. Uh, Roy's plane, let by the live tracker, lands in six hours. Apple Maps says we will be in Austin in six hours. Let's see if that, how that goes. Welcome to Texas. Texas! All right, we are looking for the. We're actually about. Area. We made it about 15 minutes early, I think. Traffic 10, 15 was minutes great. Early. We had very little problems. Some idiot just about ran yep. us off the road right by a liquor store. Yep. Yep. Scott was like, "You idiot! Get off!" All right. Oh, there's a liquor store. No parking, no waiting, so we can't. Wow. No stopping. He's at pickup K. He might add a 1.75 liter. Outside of the baggage <laughs> claim here, or the outside of the bottleneck here. Pick up, I see the letter K. I do not see the Glasgowian. Is that what they call you? Glasgowian. Glasgow? Glaswegian. A Glaswegian? That's what it is. Is it a Glaswegian? Yep. There's a back glare. If you see K, tell her that I love her. Ooh. I will stand up and say, that's Roy right there. Uh, he's slender. He's a Roy right there. Right. He's filming us too. Look at that. <laughs> We're getting filmed the counter film. Roy, baby. Big Roy. <laughs> All right, we just picked up Ooh. Roy from the airport. Who's in the back? Who's in the back? <laughs> Uh, he did get a full body check, cavity checks, from right? Customs. Wait, which way am I supposed to go? Uh, left. I think he was trying to sneak in a 1.75 liter. <laughs> <laughs> Anything that's clear? Nope. Nope. <laughs> I stay so. Ten hour, ten hour flight, right, Roy? 
10 hour flight similar to your drive, no? About, uh, yeah. Yep. Took yep. us nine and a half, but we stopped in Oklahoma City for an hour. Well, Texas is a state to buy Glen Goyne, you know that, right? That's where I bought it at. Now, there's a couple of real good liquor stores here, so we might be doing some shopping tomorrow. Glen Goyne 21. Glen Goyne. That's the, that's the missing piece for you, is it? Oh, is it that is 21? right. I was thinking, it was, I picked up the 12, the 15, and the 18 here. Yep. Because I like the 15. Yeah. Well, the 21's a nice one to go for if you like Waller also. Mm, as he does. What's up, brother? How's it going? Thanks a lot for How you doing? Oh, yeah, no problem, man. Yeah. Nice to see you. What's going on, all right? Hey, big guy. How's it going, all right? Oh. How was the flight out? Yeah. <laughs> I almost had the camera out. I was like, these guys are going to hurt, you know, get the... <laughs> okay, so we are at the Whiskey Vault. We are in um, the bar area and the distillery area. Roy has his bottle of 1860. Eleanor, Emma is labeling. Uh, Bart is buying a bottle. I'm buying a bottle as well. We are getting an 1860 and an 1862. And Emma is a good sport. <laughs> Oh yeah, I'm sure. And there's the 60. At least we're asking. I don't know if it's going to be that way all weekend. <laughs> there's the 60 too. Uh, any other samples? I
Hey, Scott here. Hey, Mark. So we're at the Crowded Barrel. It is 2:30. Uh, we just got done with the opening, opening ceremony. ceremonies Crowds outside. Here. We got Sarah over here from S. Corbin Night. There's Chad. Zoom in on Chad over there. Here they come. There we go. Yeah. The crowd is filling up. So we are looking forward. We're here for uh, the rest of the day. And uh, hopefully everything goes well. We got some merchandise out. We've already sold a little bit. So. Yeah. And hopefully the lab mics are working. That's right. I'm sure they are. Oh, it's killing. Yeah, boy, hand me, hand me that. I'll show you who the cameraman is. And I said, if we cross this number, then I'll, I'll cut off my hair. <laughs> Those are the words I used, but embarrassingly so. Hold on. And in the edit, because I edit the videos, I was very careful, because in the shoot, I said, I'll cut off all my hair. And I was like, well, I don't know if I want to do that. I want to give myself an out. I'll just put it, I'll take out that word, and I'll just be all cut off my hair. Well, you guys stepped up to such an insane yeah. level. Yeah! Such a, such a ridiculous degree. It was like, well, damn it. Not only do I have to shave off all of my hair, I gotta do the world's worst series of haircuts leading up to this. Yeah. <laughs> Well, actually, the event, the event is done. Right, uh, all done. Everybody's leaving, walking out. We we're going to head way out. out. Bart needs some coffee. I do. I'm headed to get some coffee. Now, you, I believe, we, we first met you, and uh, you had a book. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I had a book. I had y'all sign it. Yes, sir. Um, I was pretty excited. Um, this is a event that I never thought was going to happen. Um, I, this was like a dream, especially for the group. And then... It just flowered and turned into something that uh, it has become elegant and beautiful. So it's just surreal to be here with everybody, be able to communicate and see all you guys and actually be able to communicate with you guys and not just see you on the screen every day. So um, it's very surreal. And So real quick, what was the, the, the best part of the event? What did you enjoy the most? It could be anything. The community. Absolutely. I agree. Every, everyone, all of the community, everybody being together, everybody just having a great time. Uh, Sarah said it a little while ago. She expected Bedlam, and this was the exact opposite. Everybody <laughs> yeah. was just here to have a great time. So. Uh -huh. Bedlam? What do yeah. you mean? Just, we're just wild running Sess around. Sess and shenanigans. <laughs> Sess and shenanigans. Sess and well, shenanigans. So, wow. Zach, Zach Andrews, if we didn't say it, by the way, where did you come in from? Houston. Okay. Yeah. So, we're, right. we're, we're in from Houston for the weekend. So overall scale of one to ten for the day for the whole opening 11 <laughs> there you go there was a rye whiskey from a local distillery that was really nice and it was not only the taste that was great but it was also the personality of the distillers um i think when you find somebody that loves their work mm -hmm. loves what they do you 100%. can't help but like like the product even more for that yes, reason you bet and that was somebody you could just, you know, <laughs> you could sit there, you could try their whiskey, and you also enjoyed talking to them. So I think was, that's what the whiskey community is about, just the 
sh the sharing, the you know, drinking whiskey, talking, having fun with each other. It's it's a great community. So 100%. that was also favorite part of the day. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so we're out with Anna and Serena. We are in the what do you call this? Yeah, what is? It's the what? The Fiddly Bits Bar. The Fiddly Bits Bar. Fiddly Bits Bar. We're open Friday through Sunday, 11 to 8, every day. Yes, we had quite sure. a bit of traffic. What was, the, what was most people drinking or get wanting today? Uh, mostly draft beer. beer. Okay. Yeah. So I've been here since Oops. April, um, still pretty new. But it's been really interesting because it's it's not just the Wizard Academy, it's the wedding chapel and the reception right. venues and then now the distillery. So it's it's a lot of things and it's amazing working here. I love whiskey. Oh, yeah. all right. Like what? What kind? What? I don't have a preference. Or do you enjoy yeah. whiskey? Yeah, I do. I like um, honey whiskey more so. Okay. Yeah. The sweeter Good. kinds. Anyway, join us. Jason from San Antonio uh, drove up. And today was met expectations, exceeded expectations. Exceeded expectations. It was great. Met a lot of people from all over the country, all over the world, uh, coming here just to uh, just to meet, talk about uh, whiskey talk, fellowship. Talk about whiskey fellowship. There you go. <laughs> you know, I really liked the, uh, the the Eleanor, which was kind of uh, the centerpiece of of today for the uh, the crowded bell crowded barrel um, offering. I really liked their what was it the eighteen fifty eight. Beautiful. was because they have four different offerings right. and i think that was one and i think uh for me that's apple pie cinnamon baking spices it was amazing all Beautiful. right jason well uh safe travels back yeah. you nice as to well. meet you thank you good to meet you, you as well thank you this is brian and is tammy. tammy tammy okay from indiana indiana yeah there's a good trip we had some excellent american single malts you yeah. need to text that's out that kind of single Texas. malt. it yeah. was good right. Texas makes some good whiskey. Yeah. I like. I had to. I didn't have that one. I did try the Yellow Rose yeah. single malt. Yellow Rose is really good. Yeah, yeah. yeah. perfect. It's really good too. What's yeah. been What's been your favorite thing about the day? Uh, the people, definitely, definitely perfect. the people. Me and the boys, and getting to <laughs> test <laughs> Hey, it's the Scotch. We stopped that again. <laughs> Everybody, you know, you we're know who drunk. we are. We're this punch is. Drunk. And we're not drunk. We're just punch drunk. We're That's tired. Right. We're tired. It's been a long day. Long. We day. are in Austin. One thing on my to-do list when coming here was to sit down with Roy and share Compass Box the General. This is us, Bart, Scott, and Roy hanging out. We just got done with the Whiskey Tribe at the Whiskey Vault, grand opening of the Crowded Barrel. Yep, it was great. It was fun, very fun. We're exhausted. Such an amateur. I've only just worked out and that's the camera. Oh, no. <laughs> I've been stealing You're over here. Uh, hello. That's all Don't good. Don't look at the monitor. It's all right. good. <laughs> yeah, we got to go up there. So this is also really kind of the close of, of your visit, or our visit, of being able to Pick hang up. out. Yeah. Yeah. And really, we had. But I figured we would have done this Thursday night or Friday. You no, wanted to? It's just we've been. That's how busy we've been. Well, Thursday. We Other fell. stuff has been going. Right. Anyway. All right. Before I take a sip, hmm. what I a wonderful a treat this has been for me. Thank you, Solange. 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 That's a good whiskey. It is a good whiskey. I'm glad to share it with you. Share my last. Of the bottle, Roy. I am. I. I understand how privileged I am. Hold on. Right. <laughs> Hold on. I'm damn glad to meet you, boy. I'm in. <laughs> Let me. Okay. Okay. 
slant you. No, oh, yes, he's got you. Oh, yeah, that's no, right. No, no, no. Scotch it, you Scotch gods. Slant it, dummies. dummies. <laughs>